I am Slick Nick. Now let's point out, I guess what is the obvious to most people, it's not as obvious to me because this is me, but I'm a confident guy. Let, let's just say that, I'm a confident guy. And it's funny because on the internet, when you, when you watch videos about male identity and confidence, you're gonna see all these things like, oh well, I can't be confident because I don't have a full head of hair or I'm not tall or I don't make enough money, which by the way, I'm 5'9", I'm not, I'm not tall either. But they give all these superficial reasons why they can't be confident. And I guess I'm fortunate that I've never had that issue. Not because, and I think it's because my confidence is not based on my looks or you know how much money I make or anything. Like, like that's not ever what my happiness is based on or my confidence is based on. I guess I'm fortunate that the way I'm wired, confidence isn't even a real thing. You just pretend that you are or act that you are. And if you don't know what you're doing, you just don't admit it and just figure it out. And then people go along with that. And people see that as confidence and therefore you're a confident person. So I still don't think confidence exists because there's no part of me that has low self-esteem, nor is there a part of me that I'm like, oh, I'm better than other people. But as far as believing in myself and my ability to get things done, to figure them out or to recruit help to get it done, I can do those things. So I am a confident person, but I think it's interesting that my natural perception of what confidence is, it's not based on what you have or what you don't have. What would it be based on? It's based on my ability to overcome the obstacle. Yeah, that's what my confidence is. And the fact that I believe that I can overcome any obstacle, I guess gives me confidence. But I guess there's people who don't have confidence to begin with. And there's people that no matter what they look like, how tall they are, how much hair they have, how much money they have, they still won't have the same level of confidence that I will. Because for me, it's that simple. I can figure this out. I can obtain my goals. I can do what it takes. I can be more disciplined than, than, than most other guys to do what I need to do. So yes, on top of that, shave the hair off. Let's face it, it only further symbolizes that I'm a confident guy. Because we all know there's plenty of guys who would love to shave their head, whether how much hair they still have or not, but they're afraid. They'll give a reason like I don't have the right head shape or I don't know what people will say about it, or we'll, we'll, they'll give whatever reason. But for me, I give zero hesitation when I feel like doing it just to do it. So again, I feel like I'm closing every video by saying, then why don't I just keep doing it? Your comments belong right here.